The Corvallis School District is renaming an elementary school after Grand Ronde tribal member Katherine Jones Harrison. The school district is in the process of renaming three schools which were previously named after American presidents who participated in racist practices. Katherine Harrison, who is 97, was suggested as a name for the district's renaming task force because of her efforts in tribal restoration, her connection to the community, and as a way to honor local indigenous history. Ryan Noss, the Corvallis School District Superintendent, says Harrison's name is important because she's a key tribal figure of the community and also a woman. Um, at this point, all of our schools have been named after men or places. Um, so those were some of the criteria that the board set up. And so as the committee met, um, they looked at who were um, individuals that were influential um, and also people who are influential locally. Here's what else Noss says he's looking forward to with the renaming. A name and a person that can inspire others. And when our kids walk into our schools, we want them to feel that. And we also want them to walk into schools where they feel like they're valued and a part of it. And I think having a school named after Catherine does that in a way that doesn't always happen with the naming of a building or an institution. The task force is made up of 12 diverse community members ranging from fifth graders to adults. Noss said all 12 unanimously supported Harrison's name. This week on Thursday, August 12, 2021, the Corvallis School Board will take its first reading of the school's renaming resolution and take action in September. In the next school year, Noss says they will plan a formal renaming of the school and he hopes Harrison can attend to witness her legacy. You can read more at smokesignals.org. I'm Kamaya, the social media digital journalist for Smoke Signals.